Screw up. You've no doubt heard someone say that they screwed up or made a big mistake, ruined something. I screwed up. I'm sorry, your partner might tell you after you find out that he let your pet birds escape. Maybe your favorite restaurant messed up your order last time. I'm sorry about last week. We won't screw up your order today. I don't want to screw this up. You can only apply once. Your sister might be explaining why she's double checking her scholarship application. It's plain to see that if you screw up, You've made a blunder, mishandled something, or just generally messed something up. If a thing is destroyed, ruined, irreparable, or not working, then it can be described as screwed up. Don't mess up can be heard as often as don't screw up. And indeed, they have the exact same meaning, though screw is a lot less self explanatory. According to an article in the New York Times Magazine by William Sapphire, the word screw comes from the old French word escrow. And at the time referred only to the type of screw that holds wood together. Eventually, like many other things, the idiom screw up had its origins in the U.S. Army, where during World War II, soldiers would attach up to various verbs to create slang, such as foul up, mess up. Gum up, louse up, etc. The idiom screw up only really gained popularity starting in the 1980s, however, and it was about this time that screw also came to commonly be used as a euphemism for sex. If someone often makes mistakes or messes up, people might start referring to him or her as a screw up, which is not a nice thing to call a person. Suppose you often screw things up or are known as a screw up, should you let that deter you from trying your best? Definitely not. We all make mistakes, and some more than others, but we should not let failure get in the way of success. Every failure is a step to success, goes the well known proverb. Finally, my cake is perfect. I screwed it up so many times in the past, I was nervous. You might be telling your family as you bring out a most beautiful cake. Perhaps you forgot to turn off the stove. You screwed up and almost burned the house down. But the important thing is that you were not hurt, your dad might say. My computer is screwed up. The screen is frozen and I can't reset it. Your child might be complaining to you. Don't screw up this time, you might jokingly tell a friend who is about to start a piano recital. So, the next time you want to say that a person has made a mistake or a mess of things, Say that they screwed up and have ruined, mucked up, or destroyed a situation or thing. They have screwed it up.
Oh, and don't forget that screw up is slang and should only be used in informal situations.